No one doesn't like my album, but I think it's pretty good. You got a nice album. It's, it works for me. Okay. Part three in our three part file chart series. Um, we'll call this implementation. How do we implement the biochar manifesto? Who do we need to talk to? I don't know, Chris. Who? Um, it's a good question. Uh, who? Who cares the most about long-term investments? Who cares the most about who's who's really behind the infrastructure of things? Okay, we got industry. Who's behind the industry? Companies. Who's behind the companies? Employees. You got governments and banks. Banks. Okay. Banks fund the industry. Banks also fund the government, right? And the government funds the banks. So the banks and the government work together Symbiosis. and they supply the engine for industry to run on. Okay. Um, I don't know. I don't, I don't really know a whole lot about it, but that's just kind of what I came up with. These are the, <laughs> these are the people who are doing 50 year projections, you know? Industry, they only do what? 10 year projection. I mean, really? You know, they care about profit. They don't care about, I mean, what industry is really doing a 50 year projection? Does industry even make things that last 50 years? You know what? <laughs> not, not really. Yeah. So. Banks, and governments. <clears throat> okay, governments, who do you want to talk to? EPA. Start emailing people, politicians, <clears throat> Bi hey, it's, hey, it's bipartisan. Um, fisheries, uh, Gulf states. You see where this is going? Whole lot of nowhere. Anyone getting excited about any of these? Not really. Rookies. Rookies get excited about this stuff. Okay, I was laying in bed one night and I was just kind of thinking like, well, if I could talk to anyone in the world, who would I talk to? board of the world's biggest banks. That's why I'm making this presentation right now. This is for the, put the message out there to all the boards of all the banks in the world. Banks supply the money for the industry. Basically, banks approve the industry's request. Banks run the industry, okay? This is what I came up with. You could get a bank behind this project. Guess what? They, they become the greenest bank in the world. It's good for good advertising, good ads. You know, guess what? You start getting into converting deserts into grasslands, banks make a huge amount of money.
property values skyrocketing. Property. There's got to be some kind of banker manifesto, you know, like the um, Hippocratic Oath that doctors take. I'll bet you there's some some kind of Latin thing that the uh, right. very first bankers started. Uh, And banks are protected too, with the fractional reserve banking system. They, <laughs> they can do it. They can fund this project with very little risk. And they have enough strings and that banks, you see banks have lobbyists. I'll bet you they're the biggest banks in the world, I bet you they all have at least a hundred lobbyists full time. So this is how banks affect the government perhaps more than humans, uh, civilians, because civilians, we don't have lobbyists, we have elected officials. Industry has lobbyists, banks have lobbyists. These are the people hanging around the Capitol buildings, pulling strings, passing money around, pulling strings, giving these guys back massages while they're waiting 10 hours in the courtroom. <laughs> Access to lobbyists. Um. Okay. CEOs in red tide zones if you live along the ocean chances are you get the red tide coming in you get fish big fish kills coming in and the reason why is because of farm runoff fertilizer running into the ocean. So we don't have, biochar, we don't have that problem. So let's say a CEO, rich and powerful, you live in all the water, you got your nice boat and your pool and, and your fishing set up. And, and guess what? Oh, you got a problem with the red tide? Call your lobbyists, You're like, hey guys, let's get biochar going in these regions here and here on these. Done. Pull the strings. Government, call call me, order up your biochar. I'm selling it by the semi load, $28,000 $28, for 28 tons, give or take. Midwest Biochar, Midwest LLC. Bio, yeah, Midwest Biochar, LLC.